Today is National Volunteer Day. It is part of the overall celebration of the third anniversary of the Team Unity Administration. We have come to Keys today to do some volunteer work to paint this house for Bernard Thompson. Bernard Thompson is a man who worked for a long time for the government, sweeping our drains, keeping the community clean. But over time, he became sick and lost one of his legs. So he's an amputee and cannot perform the role of the role he had to use to, to play in cleaning the community any longer. And for years he was housed in this small wooden house just next door. And under the last administration, the decision was made to build this one-room apartment for him. But it lacked a couple of things. It lacked electricity, it lacked water, and it was not painted. Over the last two or three years since I am in the parliamentary representative, we have got the water connection, we have worked on the electricity connection, and um, now today is a volunteer day, we're working on painting the property. We want to thank those who have come out from the Keys community group, headed by Mr. Griffin. Royston Griffin is a long-time community activist, a long-time community leader, one who has uh, educated himself and who has engaged the Keys community in positive things. I have participated in many, many events that the Keys community uh, hosted and today is no less an event than those which has gone in the past. And so today I want to congratulate them on their efforts on this initiative. It is an initiative which has been encouraged by the government throughout the entire country. And so today, as they paint, I trust that it will make the occupant of this house feel a lot more comfortable in that his surroundings is much more welcoming. And so, I, while congratulations is, is, is good for the government, congratulations is good for the people from Keys. And also, I applaud the gentleman, Mr. Thompson, for his hard work that he has put in to our government for many years. So I trust that um, throughout the entire country today, there have been many, many other recipients of the volunteerism, which is being encouraged by the Team Unity government. It is part of my own ministry's endeavor to improve the quality of life of the poor and indigent. Only a few weeks ago you saw that we gave a home to an 80-year-old person who worked more than 50 years in the sugar industry and was practically living outdoors in that the property in which she was housed you could see right through it. Miss Daniel benefited from that and only a few weeks ago you also saw the lady from New Road, Miss, Miss Cornelius, whose house had just uh, dilapidated bags and, and canvases as roofing, so that whenever rain falls, nothing in the house is left spared without being wet. We refurbished that house and put it back in a nicely, in an importantly improved uh, home. So it is part of our program in the ministry to raise the quality of life of those who are poor and indigent. This is one such project coming on national, on a national day, a national volunteerism day. It is one of that, those projects which helps to raise the quality of life of the people of St. Kitts and Nevis. Today, um, as we celebrate the National Volunteer Day, we are now painting Bernard Thompson House. Um, it's been a while since I visited him and I realized that the house needs some painting. So I spoke to him some time ago and he said he would be happy to get the assistance. So after I was contacted, I came and visited him and told him, well, I'll make the suggestion to 
that other part of the activity we would like to paint his house so he said he would be happy for that to happen. Okay. He's a uh, amputee and I've known him from since birth and I always had great respect for him and seeing him around the community and when he was on his feet he would always go around and you know make his joke and make everybody feel comfortable around him so you know it's a way for me to give back and for the people of Keys to give back to the community and this is an opportunity for us to um, take part in this project. Helping our brother up, giving helping Helping a sister up, giving a helping hand. Yeah, yeah. We were wrong, giving a helping hand. And we were wrong, giving a helping hand. Helping a sister up, giving a helping hand. Stay up to date with news, programs, and activities of the government with SKNIS. Like us on Facebook. Listen to us on SoundCloud. Follow us on Twitter. And watch our videos on YouTube. Connect with us today. SKNIS, St. Kitts and Nevis Information Service.